how your team was able to lock it down defensively against the top scoring offense? I, I thought we did a good job. Um, I, I thought our last two games, the second and the third period, we did not come off the puck and we were able to, um, we didn't sit on it, right? We made smart decisions, so we made it, we didn't force some offense that might have got us to five, but we didn't force anything like that. But I didn't think we sat back or came off it, and I liked uh, the intensity of that. The second period was a really good setup period for us because we had some good physicality and some good zone time, and that wears defenses down. So it limits their ability to push in the third, and so that was good. What can you say of Sergei Bobrovsky's oh, man, especially early Early. On well, and that's – it changes everything, right? They're the highest-scoring team in the National Hockey League. They come out and have a good feeling in the first five minutes because they score on that power play. you got a completely different animal you got to deal with. And he was just right and solid. And uh, there's, there's no easy shots on that team, even the ones from the outside that he, he had to work hard to see. And then when, if he saw it, he stopped it. But he was really, really good. Seeing the new lines for a full game, do you feel like it made things a little bit deeper? And it seemed like the third line. I the thought uh, – you know? right. So that would be the maybe the obvious. Because if you look at Barkoff and Bennett, you would say that – that one of those two lines will be prolific in a game for the most part, but I like that line. Um, and I thought Stenlin's line, right? They were over 11 minutes in a non for Stenlin in a non penalty kill role, right? We only had the one. So the third and fourth lines look, made us look really solid to Katie's point, kind of full 60 minutes. Well, you're not getting a full 60 minutes unless you have everybody kind of involved in the game and they, their play allowed that. We've talked about Matthew Kachuk a lot and his, the way his season has progressed, but now he's leading the NHL in points since January 1st. Yeah. So what can you say about the way he's I say, turned his game around? Yeah. I guess, just so I would say the way he offensively returned to form because his defensive game in that first stretch was markedly better than it was last year at this time. And not that he, just in terms of everybody had to learn a different style of play, okay? So that he, he had. He learned that in the first half, and then, but he kept it. He was very, very good when those two defensemen were out. Matthew was, and and what I appreciated, and what the coaches especially appreciated, is his numbers weren't great at the start. We needed him to defend a certain way because of the the missing pieces on our blue line, and and he never changed his game and never once cheated for it. So he worked real hard to get kind of we got those guys back. I think we could maybe do a little bit more offensively. And uh, he's back looking. He's a better player right now than he was last year at this time, for sure. Sasha scored his first in a while. I mean, what yeah. did you see from him tonight? I think he's played almost the exact same game. Like, he had an injury that he's played all year. He's been really, really good and a big part. I know the two of the points are, are power play points, but that's all part of it. He's a big part of Sam Reinhardt's, you know, incredible, incredible goal scoring year. Um, but his game has been really good. And then the injury slowed him down a little bit. And I thought tonight he came back looking like he was fully healed. So he's, he's in the lineup. We're not playing him. He's not. It's just you take the time off. It takes you a little while to get back going again. And tonight he looked like he was going. And then just speaking for the power play, I mean, tonight especially, the passing was really quick. And it, they connected yeah. pretty quickly. I mean, what have you seen from them lately? I mean, we had a stretch. It was a little bit like last year, but but not, I guess. Because at the start of the year at analytics, our, our power play was lead. It just wasn't scoring at all. And then it, our power play has been very, very good. And it's won us a whole bunch of games. And that's this 20-game block that we're in, I think we've got 15 wins. So our power play has been a big part of it. But the first power play the last game was slow. And give Jamie Compon credit, but certainly the players executed all of it. They kind of took that power play and went faster. We scored the goal that was big. The, a Reinhardt goal on the power play last game, but tonight it came out looking like it had grown from, from the game, from the experience of last game. For yourself, uh, fifth all-time in wins, now sole possession. Mm -hmm. Is it, so do you ever look at kind of the company you're in now as you start to, to climb, and what does that mean to you to be counted among names like that? Yeah, I would say a couple of things. Uh, I, think, I think I probably took stock of moving into second because it's Mr. Bowman is first. That's, uh, but we need to win a Stanley Cup to truly enjoy it. So the rest of them I don't spend much time thinking about. Did you like what you saw out of Nick Cousins on that side of the line tonight? I did. I thought he controlled some pucks in the offensive zone. And when he got out there, he looked like he had played with those guys before. It wasn't really an audition. Did some good chances. Um, and I think this three-game break will be good. Sam Bennett was a little under the weather there last week uh, during the break. And... and 
he get he he was feeling better tonight, but not great in the two previous. So these guys get three days. I think I think he goes there, but we also went to a heavier forecheck game our last two games, and that's what Cousins can do on that line. He can hang on the pucks in the offensive zone off a of forecheck. So I think that line can be better. I wasn't disappointed with it at all. They played hard. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, everybody. All right. Good.